Greetings to all, today I want to show a way to attach another object to the Alembic cache so that it moves behind it. Using a simple example, I'll show you, I have a rigged character to whom I want to add an item so that it follows him when I export this animation to the Alembic cache. In a normal situation, it is possible to attach an object through bones or in another way so that it follows another since the coordinates of the object change. But often, I need to bake an animation and I couldn't find a way to attach an object to the Alembic cache. Hello mobile game advertising. When we receive the Alembic cache to attach an object to it, we select its face of the object that the object will follow, and through the shift we select the object that will follow it. Go to the rigging panel, then constrain and select point on poly. We get the result. Here, you already decide on which axis it will repeat the movements, at what height you want to leave it, or you just need to attach it to a certain place for me in mobile advertising. It was often necessary for circles of different colors, to stand under the characters, denoting who is the enemy, ally, and so on. Sometimes it turns out that the object is not in the center, or you want to put it in a different position. To move it in the right direction, select all the faces of the object and put it where you need. And I will show you a problem that you can face. When importing cache alembics and trying to connect an object to it in this way, it turns out that the object does not connect and remains in place. This is due to the fact that the offset is not selected correctly and we need to go to the of editor and select the set we need. And after that, we'll be fine. I hope the lesson will help someone, good luck.